Mercy breaks ground on what they call a game changer for gastrointestinal care. A new facility dedicated to digestive health. And the name has a special meaning. News Force Caitlin Ogle has more. This site will become the Catherine Ann Minders Digestive Health Institute. Mercy says it will help them expand the number of patients with special GI needs they can help. And may Almighty God bless this ground and all who will work and be served here. The name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. With the ground freshly broken and blessed, construction on the new Catherine Ann Minders Digestive Health Institute can begin after Herman Minders donated $7.5 million for the state-of-the-art facility. You may have heard that name before, from the Minders School of Business at OCU or the pyramid-shaped building at Mercy, the Minders Neuroscience Center. But this building is extra special, named after his late daughter, Kathy. Her first love was kids and education. She uh, taught up in Denver uh, right upon her death. Uh, she was at the age of 42 when she passed away in 2008. Doctors say countless people struggle with some sort of gastrointestinal challenge. And that may range from the occasional heartburn to irritable bowel syndrome to colon cancer. And we all know that colon cancer is the second most common type of cancer death when numbers for men and women are combined. GI doctors say this 52,000 square foot institute will be a game changer with its seven procedure rooms, 21 prep and recovery rooms, ambulatory services, clinics, and a chapel. It's the only facility of its kind in our state. Mercy says the only other facility like it is 500 miles away. The Minders family hopes this will serve as a beacon of hope and a reminder of a precious life lost. Kathy would be highly honored to know that her legacy is going to live on long past all of us. This building will be here forever. In Oklahoma City, Caitlin Ogle, Oklahoma's News 4. A special gift in the name of a special person. Mm -hmm. Construction is expected to be finished by the fall of 2026. Wonderful tribute to their daughter. Yes.